And uh, welcome back to another episode of Nick and Jeff. Just Jeff here again today, and today I thought it'd be fun to look at the uh, Cosmic Red new PS5 controller I just got. I've been waiting a long time for a new colour, and I don't like black because black's boring, so I thought I'd try and go for the red. And at $119, it's a very expensive controller. And now that we've finally removed it from its box, it's time to look at this thing. Get a little pamphlet, of course. But no one cares about those. And there we have one cosmic red controller. And I'm still not so sure about the color. I thought it might be more burgundy. But it's actually kind of more maroon. It's got like a little bit of a pinkish tone to it. Got all the uh, informational symbols at the back, but yeah. I think I'm going to be real with you. It doesn't really match the PS5 aesthetics at all. Like, it just feels off. It doesn't go with the rest of it. All the other accessories have this, you know, white and black sleek look. And the red just... Ugh. Yeah. Still just... I'm not a fan. I thought it would grow on me. I didn't want it at first, but... The only other option was black. And so I had to go with this. And what makes things even worse? $119 and they don't even include a USB cable in the box. I love USB-C cables. I never have enough. And now I don't have another one. Ugh. Now, of course, red controllers play exactly the same as any other color. They don't make you go faster and they don't make you win anymore. And I still lose against Nick, so that's fine. And if there's drift, well, I don't know. I've never had drift before, but apparently it's exactly the same. So they probably haven't changed anything. It just doesn't pop, and I know it's Cosmic Red, and Cosmic Red isn't all about popping, but when you compare them to the Switch Joy-Cons, which are really hard to capture on camera, it just doesn't look as nice. I kind of wish they put colour into the buttons, or maybe even made some of it white, to at least match the PS5. Honestly, if you're on the fence about this controller, I wouldn't recommend it. It's really not red, it's maroon, and the maroon matches the same Queensland maroons. And I don't care about sport, and I don't want to look at my controller and think about sport, so... You know what? Don't do it. So did you pick up any new controllers, Midnight Black, Cosmic Red, or just sit on the fence and didn't get any? That's probably the best option because none of them are any good.